400 people packed a room at the Ted Constan Center in Norfolk tonight for a forum on offshore drilling. Among the speakers, Governor Ralph Northam. It was only the latest of several events that began popping up after President Donald Trump said that he wanted to open the Atlantic coastline to oil and gas exploration. To turn on your side, investigative reporter Chris Horn was there. And, and Chris, where does the governor stand on this issue? Oh, Anita, he's adamantly opposed, just as about virtually all of the Atlantic coast governors are. So it was kind of tough to find anyone in the room who supported offshore drilling. We did find one. We'll get to him in a moment. Northam and the other panelists, though, say offshore drilling would hurt our economy and put our beaches and marine life at unnecessary risk. Whenever oil is handled around the water, a certain percentage gets into that water. More than 400 people wanted to hear about offshore drilling and how Governor Ralph Northam feels about it. We need to wean ourselves away from fossil fuels and, and move toward renewable energy. And the last thing that we need to do right now is to put oil rigs off our coast. The panel and the room was largely against oil rigs off our coast. We did find a supporter, the head of the Virginia Petroleum Council. The biggest benefits that we would see would be economic, I would argue. Uh, the average oil and gas job pays over $100,000 a year. But opponents say an oil spill could be devastating to our economy. Our economy depends so much on the resort and the, the money that it brings in every year, and that's just vital to us. So far, the Interior Department has held one official hearing on offshore drilling in Virginia in Richmond, 100 miles from any coastline. Northam says that is short-sighted, and beach resident Karen Lyons calls it unfair. It's, it's not a fair representation mm -hmm. of, of the, for, for the people that live right on the coast that it would impact us the greatest. And beach developer Bruce Thompson says oil rigs would put too much at risk. Not only our tourism industry, but our overall quality of life. That's absurd and obscene, and I won't stand for it anymore. Now, Florida was able to get an exemption from offshore drilling. Governor Northam says he wants a similar one for Virginia, but has yet to hear back from Interior Secretary Ryan Zinke. Chris Horn, 10 on your side.